Hi, this is Jason Gorman from Codemanship with another Code Smell of the Week. This time we're looking at data classes. Data classes are just classes that have fields and getters and setters, but no actual behavior. One of the goals of object oriented design is to put the behavior where the data is. In other words, put methods that act on fields in the same classes that contain those fields. Here's an ex example where we've broken that rule of thumb we have two data classes, a customer data class, which is just a bunch of customer fields with some getters and setters, and an address data class, which is just a bunch of address fields with getters and setters. And then we've got some behavior, a method called get customer summary inside this customer summary view class, which is generating a string based on the values of fields of these other uh, data classes. To refactor this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this method keeping a delegate so that we don't have to change the tests. I'm going to move this method into the customer class where arguably it belongs because that's where the customer fields are. And of course we hit F11, run the tests, all looks good. Now if you look inside our customer class, we've now got our get customer summary method. This address line here, this line of code here, is no longer needed because address is a field of customer. So we can just get rid of that and run the tests and it all looks pretty good to me. Right now we're not quite finished because now we've got accessing a bunch of fields here on address so arguably this expression here belongs on the address class where those fields are. In order to refactor this I'm going to extract this expression into its own method like so. Let's just call it get address summary run the tests I can get rid of those parentheses now because they were only needed to make the automated refactoring work and now all I have to do is move get address summary over to the address class and run the tests. So there you have it. Customer Summary View now no longer contains logic that accesses those fields. The logic that accesses the fields are inside the classes where those fields are and they're no longer just data classes.